Module 9 The Pros and Amp, Cons of Using Technology Technology has invaded the classroom. A generation ago, students were lucky enough to have a computer lab in their school. Today's students use computers for many tasks, including reports, presentations, and testing. The internet has allowed for a plethora of technological tools to come into the classroom as well. Instead of watching an educational television program, students can now play interactive games and compete with one another to further the learning process. Using technology has some definite advantages. There are also potential risks that must be considered when introducing technology into the classroom environment. The advantages follow, 1. It provides credibility for the teacher. 2. It provides access to numerous resources instantly. 3. It automates the boring stuff. By automating more of the tedious work that teachers do every day like assessing homework, preparing worksheet, there is more time for actual teaching and less time spent at home reviewing work. 4. It creates a collaborative learning approach so students can retain most of the information they study. 5. It is an easy way to learn core vocational skills. All vital skills for the modern workplace like proper writing etiquette, creating presentation and today's students have the opportunity to master them before they even start looking for a job. 6. It allows the classroom to reflect modern times. 7. It can put all the needed data into one location. 8. It allows students to work at their own comfortable pace. 9. It can boost learning motivation. 10. It provides an opportunity to learn different ways. The disadvantages follow. 1. It can be distracting to students if spent more hours with the gadgets. 2. It can disconnect students from face-to-face -face relationships as sometimes regular social interactions for the comfort of a screen, words, and emojis. 3. It can make it easier to cheat. 4. It could put some students at a disadvantage because the idea of incorporating modern technology into their lives is a secondary comparison to their basic needs of living. 5. It could cause students to use unreliable resources for learning. 6. It can make curriculum planning more difficult or expensive. 7. It can replace the teacher. 8. It can create issues of privacy. 9. It could create medical issues for some students that include irritation of the eye, feelings of fatigue, and even blurred vision. It may also lead to a more severe condition that is called computer vision syndrome. 10. It may cause children to lose track of time as they spend more time on gadgets. These can sometimes disturb the flow of life. 11. It can create a dependence on both teachers and students.